Hello guys, I'm back again. Today I will be showing off a new stone that uh, I recently got in the web shop. Um, a stone that will suit many as a finishing stone for kitchen knives. For the nerds, sadly, they won't uh, agree because they want a much uh, nicer edge. But this stone is the Nubatama Bamboo 5K stone. The orange uh, small brick here, it looks like a brick almost. And um, as I said, it's a 5K stone that uh, will suit many in, uh, as a finishing stone in kitchen knives. So, I will uh, sharpen the a small Tanaka Kito 180 blue steel Damascus. I did uh, put an edge on here that is a 1k uh, Ume series. So let's see what this uh, stone can deliver for us. Oh, look at here. Look at this. It takes steel right off. Whew. Feels quite hard, and damn, it aches. <laughs> this is very fast stone for a 5k. And it, it looks like uh, it's uh, almost all of it is metal swarf. Not much of the stone coming off. So uh, this will be one of the stones that I will have in my setup. I can guarantee you all. Getting the heel area area is quite tough sometimes. But uh, oh yeah, I hit it quite hard. <laughs> this was not what I expected from a 5k stone. I love my 4k Ume series, the green uh, Kermit stone almost in color. Uh, I really really like it but maybe this will take its place instead because the difference between a 4k and a 5k stone isn't that much so I think I would invest my money on this uh, orange brick instead <laughs> this is a pure joy to work with oh yeah Going quite low here to see if I can cover the area that I did scratch up earlier. So, look at this. Whew. One shiny finish. I really like this one. This knife is not so hard, so uh, of course it goes a little quicker on this one, this knife. But if you are having an Agami Super or something like that, it will take longer time. But uh, the finish will be the same, I can say. So... Let's see how it looks. Oh yeah. One really shiny finish. So, I will wipe it off and you can see. Let's 
you can see that this one shiny edge all the way and uh, that is a nice edge touch here to get rid of any burr that is on the edge I don't like to break it off like doing like this I like to go against the edge with a very very light touch Here on this part you can see the shiny finish at least. So this is great. Whew. Well I'm home hairless in a spot right here. And uh, that wasn't so hard. Well, I think that will uh, concludes. This concludes the video. Uh, I will, uh, as I said, there is not many. I just got one stone left, and. Uh, we are having a trouble here in Sweden with the taxes and so on. So, uh, and the shipment from Japan to Sweden is so expensive. And Mr. Ken, he has been very, very polite or uh, kind to me to uh, help me out with uh, any questions and uh, so that I have. This is love by me. Well. See you. Bye.